Cat owners! Hi, Rena Cat Rescue, and I'm here to tell you about a dangerous toy that you might have purchased for your cat. Uh, there's, it's not a brand name, it's a thing on a toy, so I'm gonna show you and explain. Are you ready? I'm gonna have to show you pictures because I just went through our entire toy bin and our rescue and I literally don't have any in the entire facility because that's how dangerous these are. Feathers. Any cat toy with feathers on it, you need to clip them off immediately. Why? Because your cat's gonna eat these. And if your cat eats these, they're probably not gonna pass them, which means to one of two things. You're gonna either have to pay to get this removed from the inside of your cat's body, you're gonna have to pay to get the vet to get the cat to throw it up, or you're gonna lose your cat. Ah, uh, I hate it! And that goes for any feather toy. This is a stick toy with a feather on the end. A lot of people have these. There's so many better stick toy options on the market without a feather. Don't do it. If you do have one of these, you should only play with them when you're supervised. It needs to be in a locked cabinet that your cat cannot get into when you are not home. Feathers should really just not be in your home at all if you have a cat, but if you do have them, they need to be locked up when you're not around. Even this. This is a kick stick. I've had these kick sticks in the rescue. We just cut the feathers right off. Snip, 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 snip. The cats still love the toy because it's a kick stick. The cats love to kick them. But the feathers chewing in their belly, we have to get them removed from their intestines via surgery. And that's expensive and totally, totally something you can just, what, what's the word? Avoid. I was looking for the word avoid. You can just avoid that surgery and your cat getting sick and all the money and all of that all together by just cutting the feathers off the toy before you give it to them. I know what you're thinking. You're like, but my cat loves this feather toy so much. I get it. But it's going to cost so much when they eat it and you have to surgically remove it from their intestines or you're going to lose your cat. Your cats will still enjoy the toy. You just need to clip the feathers off and throw them away in a safe garbage can that your cat get, can't get into before you give your animal the toy to play with. As for stick toys, there are lots of amazing toys on the market that are still on sticks that don't contain feathers. Even if they do have some feathers on them, you can just cut them off and still use the stick toy. Your pet won't know what they're missing and you're potentially saving their life, so it's worth it. Thanks for taking my recommendation. Wish you the best. Before that Karen or Jared comes in my comments and tells me that their cat eats feathers all the time and doesn't need to get them surgically removed from their stomach, cats who have been adopted from my rescue, their owners have reached out and told me that their cat passed away due to this before. I know cats who have passed away from this, not in my facility, but after they were adopted. So it is a thing. Stop letting your cats eat feathers. Thank you and have a great day.